Yes, as the wind is picking up, man. Um, <laughs> did the wind pick up and give us a blow up the backside for a performance like that? Um, or was it just partisan and we're supposed to do that? Um, where do you stand on, on, on the win today? I mean, yeah, it's partisan. Like, we're supposed to do this. But overall, I'm happy with the win. Our free forwards got the three goals today. Martial, man, that goal was world class, man. Mm. He's, when he celebrated that goal, through his head, he must have thought like, yo, Deshaun, are you looking? Because he's yeah. not been selected, you know? Yeah, so. Yeah. You must have thought, listen, you should have picked me over Lamar. Yeah. But yeah, anyway, um, I'm happy with the win today. Uh, free to the round of 32, but this is where the real competition starts. Because the teams from the Champions League are going to drop down to the Europa League. We could get the likes into Milan, by Leverkusen, anyone actually, because anyone, anything's possible if you exactly. look at the groups. Um, we could get a Leipzig, do you know what I mean? And them are on fire, do you know what I mean? So against those teams, we could get slapped. Worst, with, our, worst with, with our strongest team. With our strongest team. Yeah. That's the worst case that could happen mm. at Old Trafford as well. Um, but yeah, man, I just think we've got to look at the bigger picture. I don't know um, about the injuries of McTominay and then Maguire. I hope I mean, it's yeah, not too... That's the thing. I got to because we said about it was such a strong team for tonight. It almost seemed like you know Solskjaer's not worried, but wants to put his strongest team out, get it done and dusted. Yeah. But he could have rested Maguire today. He should have. Just just play Phil Jones. Yeah. Phil Jones and Rojo. Happy days. Yeah. Um, Wamba Saka played again. Uh, okay, maybe Williams could have came in. Mm. Uh, okay, but Ashley Young suspended for the next game. Um, and McTominay and Fred is kind of like well. Maybe he should have just started Ghana. I know Ghana didn't come on and cover himself in glory, but yeah. to maybe just protect against the injuries. Is that too easy to say that because football is a funny game? Yeah. Or would you have liked to have seen a couple of players more rested? Of course, man. We should have rested a lot of players today. Yes, you know, Ghana's a young, he's a young kid mm. and, you know, you want to bed him in and stuff. But those are the kind of games that you use to bed yeah. him in. Do you see him? Give him 90 minutes. Let him, do, let him make his mistakes. Let him learn from his mistakes. Yeah. And then in the next game, he can, he can improve. Do you yeah. see what I'm saying? So a lot of players should have been rested today. So I don't know what's, what's going on with Matomini, but if worse comes worse, they come out and say he's out for the Brighton game. Mm. Do you know what I mean? We're going we're gonna to look at Oli like, come on, bro, mm. you, sh you shouldn't have played him. Mm. You could have rested him today. Um, so, yeah, I, I think it's just he has to learn he has to learn to rest players more. Mm. I know that, he, that he's got love for certain players and he wants to play them, he wants them to get their goals and whatever or get their minutes, but you have to be able to say, yo, today I'm going to rest you. And he did that today with Daniel James, mm. but that's because he likes him so yeah, much. Yeah, and needs no, him to play. Yeah, don't just do that with him. Do yeah. it with other players as well that you maybe don't like as much, but we need those players because mm. the squad is already thin mm. and we can need, we need all the players that we can, we can use. On, on today's performance, did... We've seen playing against lesser oppositions how we've struggled, yeah. especially when we don't get the first goal kind of early ish. The fact that we did get an early goal today with through Mason Greenwood, well taken as well, give the keeper yeah. the eyes, um, which was good from him. Did that help us getting, getting, the early, getting the early goal? And was you pleased with the way we went on from that? Because they spoke in the press conferences about getting the first goal, but not, you know, putting teams to the sword, getting the second, getting the third, etc. But we yeah. saw that a bit today. Yeah, that was one of our biggest problems, you know, scoring one goal and yeah. then just sitting back and then be satisfied with one. And today we scored one, we scored two, three. Second half, uh, I took the foot a bit off the, the gas, in my opinion. We could have had four, five, six, in my opinion, in the first half. Rashford, four chances, could have scored four by himself. Yeah. Um, but yeah, I'm happy that today we didn't just be, we, we weren't happy with just one goal. Mm. We wanted the second and the third. And obviously, after the third, though, we did actually just drop off. I know you made the changes and yeah. the fluidity just kind of went. Lingard came on, yeah. didn't really realise he was on. Ghana came on, did okay. Pereira wasn't great, he gave the ball away quite a lot. And it's like that. The intent to go on to kick on from three to get four to get five. Yeah. I mean, we can't expect too much, eh? I mean, I know what you mean, but still, it's, it's partisan. Yeah, yeah, it's partisan. You should be able to kill teams yeah. off like this. Yeah. Send them back home with six, seven goals, man. Do that. Yeah. To let the people know, like, yo, when yeah. Man United, we're here in this competition, we're here to it's win. It's not it. something we've had for a long time, is it? It's a very long time, yeah. And it's, it's very unfortunate because we've actually got the players to do that. Do you know what I mean? Mm. So, um, yeah, but overall, I'm happy that today, you know, we got the... Didn't just, we weren't just happy with one, we got the second and the third, yeah. and that's all that matters. Who was the man of the match? Marsh, yeah, man, he was outstanding for me today. Again, and we need to protect this guy at all costs. <laughs> we need to protect this guy, make sure that he doesn't get injured because, like Saeed said, man, he could be our savior for the next games, man. So, yeah, Marsh, yeah. Respect, bro. Big thank you to you guys for watching the latest of our videos. And if you want to check out more, make sure you do that just to the right of me. We are the biggest and best Manchester United channel in the world. Make sure you check us out on all of the socials as well. Facebook, Instagram, Twitter and YouTube. The socials are along the bottom. Peace.